every day to send me to the best schools. They paid for me to go to every school I went to. I was a straight A student, athletic, great home life. But then I became DMC, one of the guys who run DMC. No, we're the baddest of the bad. Cool of the cool of DMC, I rock and roll. At the age of 35, I found out that I was a doctor. And I didn't know. So it really, really changed my life. And I was laying in the bed after we did a show and I was like, I'm DMC, what does this all mean? You know, what am I DMC for? Am I here just to be this rap dude? Now, when I asked that question, I didn't know I was gonna get the answer for everything. So, for me, being a rap dude, that's all cool. DMC is gonna be all right. But I'm here representing all those little kids. I'm here as Daryl. There's a lot of kids who living through hell. They don't know how to voice what they're going through. That's why there's suicide, that's why there's drug addiction, that's why they act out in violence. Like when I see a kid doing something in the street, I go up to him and, and tell him, yo, what you doing, man, I'm gonna punch you in your head. And he go, you, you ain't telling me you ain't my dad. I say, yes I am. He'll stand there and listen because even if that's just one encounter, what those kids want is somebody to tell them, I'm gonna bust you upside your head because then they walk away from you saying, wow, that man cares for me. But if we walk around and let them run wild and stuff like that, what they gonna do? They're gonna become unproductive, wild, violent ass people. If you can't become a foster parent, you could become a mentor to a child at risk or who doesn't have parents at home. I represent them because I was there. I could relate to them and they need stuff like this.